So we are experiencing a little bit of difficulty with our connection at this time. Uh, and uh, and the uh, we will be getting the final will be uploading the later on as well. So your starter, Skylar Shatswell, Brooklyn Baker, Kalina Ricketts, Macy Young, and Jordan Jackson. The starter is for the Deer Lady Antlers is Ashlyn Davis, Ashlyn Denniston, Jessica Dodson, Jade Williams, and Bradley Davis. Lady Bears basketball to start the game off. Shaftwell gets it over to Jackson. Baker with it on the left-hand side now. Gets it to Jackson in the corner. Macy Young takes a little step and makes a bucket right there. Bears putting some pressure on him. Jordan Jackson picks that one off of Davis and makes a quick bucket. Score now four to zero. Davis with the basketball for the Lady Antlers gets it over to Williams. Back to Davis. Davis on the right side. Gets stolen by Kalina Ricketts. Ricketts pushing the ball down the floor. Ricketts misses the shot. Great move on that shot, though. It's rebounded by Riley Davis. That's going to be off the Lady Bears. It's going to stay Antlers basketball. going to be Ashlyn Davis with the basketball for the Lady Antlers. She's guarded by Shatswell. She gets it in to Ashlyn Denniston. Back into Denniston, guarded by Young. And we've got a double dribble on Denniston right there. Jordan Jackson with the basketball coming down the floor. Shatswell. Misses the shot, and it's going to go out on the Lady Bears, or Lady Antlers. Four to zero is your score right now. No fouls on either team. Baker taking it out, gets it into Jordan Jackson. Jackson making a little move there, gets it to Shaftwell. Macy Young with a shot from the block. three, Davis with the basketball gets it over to Ashlyn Davis. Denniston inside, posting up Macy Young. Posting her up again. She turns. Bucket's a little off and it's going to be out of bounds on the Lady Antlers. 536 left in this quarter. Lady Bears leading by six. Brooklyn Baker with it, gets it into clean of Ricketts. Ricketts with an easy buck. Eight to zero right now. Lady Bears 
leading the Lady Antlers. Davis gets it into Denniston, kicks it back out to Williams, who gets a three-point basket off the glass. Felina in to Macy Young for a quick bucket, and we've got a timeout, Lady Antlers. is proud to sponsor Bears Basketball as they continue to build a winning tradition. Corsi Smoked Meats in St. Joe, Arkansas has bacon, ham, cheese, bacon, turkey, summer sausage, bacon, deer sausage. Oh yeah, did I mention they have bacon? They have great service according to Google reviewers. They're a local favorite on Facebook and have a five-star rating on Yelp. But why believe those? Go check them out for yourself and they'll make a believer out of you. Corsi Smoked Meats in St. Joe, Arkansas. Proud supporter of the Ozark Mountain Bears. Davis gets it across the floor to Williams. Back over to Davis. Denniston coming outside a little more now. Williams with it. Gets it over to Dodson. Briley gets it into Denniston. And we've got a double dribble on Denniston. Jordan Jackson bringing it down the floor for the Lady Bears. Baker with it over on the left-hand side gets it to Ricketts. Shatswell from the right-hand side gets a three-pointer. Nobody really guarding her over there. 13 to three is your score right now. Lady Bears leading the Lady Antlers by 10 at this time. Denniston gets it down to Dodson. Dodson misses the bucket there. Rebounded by Shatswell and quickly gotten down the floor to Ricketts. Twenty one Williams with it over on the side, gets it back over to Davis. Davis back up to Dodson. Lady Antlers working around. 15 to 3 is your score. Ricketts takes a swat at that. And we've got a foul on Brooklyn Baker under the goal. It's going to be Bradley Davis at the line right now. Baker didn't quite get position and Got a foul there. Uh, Riley Davis makes her first. Makes the second. Shatswell gets it into Ricketts. Ricketts tries to get it back over to Shatswell, but it's stolen by Jessica Dodson and then lost out of bounds. Baker for the three. It's good. <laughs> Baker extends Ozark Mountain's lead to 13. Davis getting it down the floor. Bradley Davis with it now. Gets it over to Williams. Williams misses the shot, but it's rebounded by Ashlyn Davis. Davis misses and then tips it out. Jackson bringing it down the floor, gets it to Baker. Baker inside to Ricketts. Ricketts drives 
and kicks it back to Baker for a two-point bucket. 15-point lead for the Lady Bears right now. Baker steals that pass. Read it like a book. And misses the shot. Rebounded by Ashlyn Davis. We've got a foul. Foul is going to be on Macy Young. 2.02 left to play. That's going to be Young's first foul. Team foul number two, I believe. Davis with the basketball out top. She works it around the perimeter. Gets it over. Back to Davis. Davis misses the bucket, and it's going to go back to the Lady Bears. Jackson brings it down the floor for the Lady Bears. Gets it to Baker. Baker, a little head fake, gets it to Shatswell. Shatswell a little off the mark there. Kalina Ricketts tries to get that rebound, and she fouls Ashlyn Davis in the process. Good hustle by Kalina Ricketts, but got a little foul on that one. Baker tips that one out of bounds. with it, looking in at Deniston. Deniston, guarded by Young, kicks it back out. Baker swats at that pass. Baker tips that one, gets the rebound. Gets it over to Young. Jackson with the basketball, gets it over to Jordan Jackson. Jordan, a little short on the three-point shot. Rebounded by Deers Dotson. Jalen is screened off by Deniston there. Deniston with basketball inside. Shots a little short, gets her own rebound. We've got to travel. Jordan Jackson bringing the ball down the floor for the Lady Bears. Your score right now is 20 to five. Ozark Mountain leading by 15. Jalen gets it in to Baker, kicks it out to Polina Ricketts. Ricketts, a little off the mark, rebounded by Jordan Jackson. 10 seconds left on the clock. Jordan Jackson with the basketball, gets it over to Baker. Baker back to Jackson. Jackson gets it to Baker. Baker, little off there, but. Makes a good decision to take that shot uh, right there. We're going to go to an ad in between quarters here. C is proud to sponsor Bears basketball as they continue to build a winning tradition.
We're back. It's Lady Antlers basketball to start the second quarter. Lady Bears leading by 15. Davis picked up by Ricketts. Gets it in to Deniston. Count the basket for Ashland Deniston. Foul was on Lady Bears, number 35, Macy Young. It was Young second. It'll be Bears basketball. Jalen gets it back to Jordan. Jalen with it on the right side, looking. Baker with it from the free throw line, turns, misses the free throw there. Ricketts makes a little drive, and it's good. 22 to seven is your score right now. Oh, there it goes. 22-7 is your score right now. Lady Bears leading by 15. Deniston with it inside, kicks it to Jalen Deniston, rebounded by Briley Davis and put back in. Cutting the Lady Bears lead to 13. Jordan Jackson getting it over to Jalen, back to Jordan. Jordan looking. Jalen for the shot outside. She's bound to count the basket for Jalen Jackson. That foul was on Deers number 11, Jalen Denniston. Jalen Jackson with a four point play right there, extending the Lady Bears lead to 17. Denniston shoots that one. Davis tips it, and it's rebounded by Baker. Baker kicks it down the court to Jordan Jackson. Jordan with an easy bucket. Twenty-eight to nine right now. And a three-point basket by Briley Davis. Brings the Lady Antlers back within 16. Jalen Jackson with a bucket. Deniston is fouled by Macy Young. That's going to be Young's third foul. We've got a crew coming in for the Lady Bears right now. Deniston's on the line, 4-2. 30-12 is your score right now. Deniston misses her first. We've got Trish Lang, Mackenzie Holder, and Skylar Shatswell returning to the lineup for the Lady Bears. Misses the second one, and it's going to be off the Lady Antlers. Jalen Jackson bringing it down for the Lady Antlers. Skylar Shatswell getting it inside to Baker. Baker takes the shot. She misses that. It's rebounded by Ashlyn Davis. Davis bringing the ball down the floor for the Lady Antlers. Baker comes out and... Is Garden Briley Davis. Deniston inside, kicks it back out to Ashland Deniston. Deniston's fouled by Lane. Deniston makes that first one.
This is the second, rebounded by Baker. Jalen Jackson bringing it down the floor. Shatswell gets it across the floor to Baker. Jackson with it on the left-hand side. Looking around, Baker with it. Baker attempts the three and is blocked. Looks like the block was by Jessica Dodson. Dodson then proceeds to grab the ball. Heads back to the Lady Antlers. Dodson misses that shot. Rebounded by Briley Davis. Denniston inside. Puts it up high off the glass. It's going to be out on the Lady Bears. Not Players didn't seem to think it was going to be Reds basketball, but it looks like it was tipped out by one of the Lady Bears under the goal. Davis with it, guarded by Jalen Jackson, laying on Denniston inside. Good team. Olivia Stone outside getting the kick out sometimes. Denniston off the glass is good. Fifteen to thirty is your score right now. Jalen Jackson with the basketball gets it into Ricketts. Shatswell for a long three. It's rebounded by Riley Davis. Riley gets it over to Ashlyn Davis to bring it down the floor. A little over 3.30 left in this half. Ashlyn Davis makes a bucket for the Lady Antlers. Lady Antlers back within 13. Shatswell gets it in for Ricketts. Ricketts tries to drive and she is fouled. 3.19 left to play in this half. Looks like that foul is on 24, Ashlyn Davis. Jackson with a shot from the right-hand corner. And it's going to be rebounded by Briley Davis. Ashlyn Davis bringing the ball down for the play. Picked up by Jalen Jackson. Jackson picks her up. Dead ball out there. Trish Lang picking up Denniston. Shatswell tips that pass. Lane tries to tip it, going back into Denniston. Davis making a drive, and we've got a foul on Jalen Jackson. That's going to be Jackson's first foul. Team foul number seven. Davis makes her first. Makes the second. We've got a timeout, Lady hey, Bears. Flip and Pump Services is a fifth generation company providing the best customer service in the water well industry since 1901. We service and install all makes and models of water well pumps and complete water systems. We have three licensed pump installers and are proud supporters of the Ozark Mountain Bears. Call Flip and Pump Services to see how we can help you today. going to be Lady Bears basketball coming back in. Lady Bears down to an 11-point lead from 15. Ricketts is blocked by Denniston. That's not running. Jalen Jackson guarding the ball out there. 
And we've got an out of bounds call. Ashlyn Davis stepping out of bounds on the side in front of the Lady Bears bench. Ricketts with it, and we've got a foul on Ashlyn Davis. Ricketts with it now, bringing it back. Ricketts goes all the way, and she's going to be fouled. Foul's going to be on number five, Olivia Hefley. Her first team score. Ricketts makes both. Davis looking to get it inside, gets it over to Stone instead. Stone looking in now. Gets it into Deniston. Deniston back to Davis. Davis puts it up. Jackson with it. It's going to be lost by Jackson. It's going to be Lady Antlers basketball. 19 to 32 is your score right now. Lady Bears leading by 13. Deniston turns. Count the basket for Deniston. Is going to be on Baker. <laughs> 10 point lead for the Lady Bears, down from 15. Shatswell with a three point basket. Lady Bears needed something to fall. Uh, they haven't been getting much from outside to fall this game so far. We had a traveling violation on Davis. Fifty-five seconds left on the clock right now. Ricketts with it. Now back over to Jalen Jackson. Baker from the corner of the free throw line. It's good. Under 30 seconds left now. Lady Bears have extended their lead back to 15. Jalen Jackson with it. 
Baker gets it to Jordan. Jordan takes the three from the right side. It's going to be picked up by Briley Davis. Jalen Jackson guarding Davis coming down the floor. She's picked up by Jordan now. Jordan steals the ball. Stolen back by Davis. Davis is picked up by Ricketts. Ricketts gets the rebound off Davis' shot. And that's going to end our first half. Ozark Mountain Bears leading 37 to 22. Corsi Smoked Meats in St. Joe, Arkansas has bacon, ham, cheese, bacon, turkey, summer sausage, bacon, deer sausage. Oh yeah, did I mention they have bacon? They have great service according to Google reviewers. They're a local favorite on Facebook and have a five-star rating on Yelp. But why believe those? Go check them out for yourself and they'll make a believer out of you. Corsi Smoked Meats in St. Joe, Arkansas. Proud supporter of the Ozark Mountain Bears. Texarkana Ag Holdings LLC is proud to sponsor Bears basketball as they continue to build a winning tradition. Corsi Smoked Meats in St. Joe, Arkansas has bacon, ham, cheese, bacon, turkey, summer sausage, bacon, deer sausage. Oh yeah, did I mention they have bacon? They have great service according to Google reviewers. They're a local favorite on Facebook and have a five-star rating on Yelp. But why believe those? Go check them out for yourself and they'll make a believer out of you. Corsi Smoked Meats in St. Joe, Arkansas. Proud supporter of the Ozark Mountain Bears.
Texarkana Ag Holdings LLC is proud to sponsor Bears Basketball as they continue to build a winning tradition. Services is a fifth generation company providing the best customer service in the water well industry since 1901. We service and install all makes and models of water well pumps and complete water systems. We have three licensed pump installers and are proud supporters of the Ozark Mountain Bears. Call Flip and Pump Services to see how we can help you today. All right, we're back. 24, Ashlyn Davis got that rebound. Your score right now. Ozark Mountain, 37. Lady Antlers, 22. Dodson with that rebound, kicking it back out to Davis. Davis misses the three. Dodson tipped it back to the bench. Jackson bringing it down. Gets it over to Shatswell. Shatswell gets it inside to Young. Young turns. Goes up. A little off the mark. Rebounded by Briley Davis. Chatswell guarding Davis. She's screened off there. Macy Young tips that one out of bounds. Briley Davis taking it out of bounds for the Lady Antlers. Dennis then gets it over to Dodson. Back out to Williams, back into Deniston. Deniston misses the shot, rebounded by Macy Young. Ricketts scores that basket. <laughs> Bradley Davis gets it over to Jessica Dodson. Davis with the basketball right now. Holding it out top. Deniston tips it out. Deniston with the rebound. Puts it back in. 
39-24 is your score. Just under six minutes left to play in the third quarter. Young with it out top. Tries to get it into Baker, but it's picked off by Ashlyn Denniston. Handlers with the rebound, and Young then gets a rebound, and she is fouled by Jessica Dodson. Shatswell misses that shot. It's picked up by... Denniston. 39 24 is your score. Young picks that one out of Davis's pocket. We're going to stay Lady Bears basketball. Brooklyn Baker taking it out right in front of the bench. Gets it in to Jackson. Jackson looking around. Ricketts, a little off the mark. Young uh, picks up the rebound, but it's tipped out by Jessica Dodson. Davis with it, gets it down to Denniston. Denniston with a bucket under the goal. Coach Kelsey Hudson wants a timeout, and we're going to take one with her. Texarkana Act. Lady Bears basketball, 26 to 39 is the score right now. Bears leading by 13. Kalina Ricketts takes a dribble there, and it gets tipped out by Jade Williams. Ashlyn Davis bringing the ball down the floor for the Lady Antlers. Williams takes the shot from the left-hand side. It's going to go back to the Lady Bears. Macy Young going up. It's going to go out on Young. We have to reset this clock. It's not connecting again. Davis with it out top. Denniston gets it over to Davis. Davis back to Jalen Denniston. Davis gets it in to Ashlyn Denniston. And we got a rebound and a foul. That was on Jessica Dodson. Looks like her second, team second of this half. Okay. 
Jordan Jackson takes the three. Baker gets the rebound, and she's blocked by Denniston. Riley Davis gets it over to Jalen Dennison. Davis looking in at Ashlyn Dennison. Davis with a shot outside. Rebounded by Riley Davis. Count the bucket if she's fouled. 28-39. Bears leading by 11. That's the Bears' first foul of this half. Davis makes her free throw, extending their comeback here. 29-39, back within 10 for the Lady Antlers. Macy Young with a basket. 41-29, 12-point lead for the Lady Bears. And we've got a foul on Macy Young. Jalen Jackson coming to the ball game. We've got uh, Mackenzie Holder also coming into the ball game for the Lady Bears. That was the fourth foul on Macy Young. Baker with the rebound there. Jordan Jackson with it out to the top. Jalen driving and right, gets it to Baker. Baker tries to get it inside, but it's stolen by Dennis Day. 41-29 right now. Bears still leading by 12. Riley Davis gets it in to Denniston. Denniston turns, misses the shot. And we've got a jump ball. 101 left in the third quarter. Ashlyn Davis gets it in. Back to Ashlyn up top. Davis and Denniston have been your primary uh, leaders for the Lady Antlers this game. Looks like that's going to be off number three foot. Briley Davis kicking that out of bounds there. Jordan Jackson with it. Gets it over to Jalen. 35 seconds left on the clock. Lena Ricketts drives a little short on that bucket. Baker tips that one. Mackenzie Holder guarding Denniston. Denniston turns and scores. 31 41. Back within 10 for the Lady Handlers. Holder gets it back to Jalen Jackson. Jalen for three. That'll end our third quarter. Lady Bears will be going in to the fourth quarter with a 13-point lead. to sponsor Bears Basketball as they continue to build a winning tradition.
Bears basketball starting the fourth quarter. Bears with a 13-point lead off of Jalen Jackson's shot there at the end. Jordan with a three. Extending the Lady Bears lead to 16 points. That is the most of the game, and we've got a foul call. On Mackenzie Holder, our first. Team's third of the half. Baker with the basketball with the steal, and she's fouled on that one. on Ashlyn Davis. It's her third, team's third foul of this half. Denniston with the rebound. 31-48 is your score. Davis with it out top, gets it into Denniston. Denniston gets it back out to, I assume, her sister. Jalen Jackson gets that rebound, pushing it down the floor. Jalen with a basket. 50-31, 19-point lead for the Lady Bears. Jalen Jackson with that foul, I believe. That's Jalen's second foul. We got a traveling violation on Jessica Dodson. Thirty-one to fifty right now. Jalen Jackson bringing the ball down the floor. Kalina Ricketts inside. Great pass by Jalen Jackson. An easy bucket for Kalina Ricketts. Denniston with it. Gets it over to Ashland Denniston and over to Davis. Davis. Davis misses that shot, and then it is rebounded by the Lady Bears, and there was a technical call on Ashlyn Davis. That'll be Davis's fourth foul. Brooklyn Baker will be on the line for two for the technical foul shot. Baker misses the first one. Baker missing both technical foul shots, but it's going to be Ozark Mountains basketball. 6.20 left to play in this game. Lady Bears leading by 21. Baker with it. Polina Ricketts tries to drive in. Baker, a lot of contact there. Uh, misses that shot. Rebounded by the Lady Antlers. Kalina tries to get a hold of that one. And there is a foul called on Briley Davis. Fifty-two thirty-one. Baker with the basketball. Jackson with it now. Back to Kalina Ricketts. Ricketts is blocked by Denniston. Denniston 
grabs the ball, gets it down the floor. And that's going to be missed by Briley Davis, but picked up by Jessica Dodson. 33-52 is your score. Bears leading by 19. Just under five minutes left. Baker with the basketball. Baker tries to get it across to Jordan Jackson, and it's picked off by Jade Williams. Timeout, Lady Antlers. Flip and Bump Services is a fifth generation company providing the best customer service in the water well industry since 1901. We service and install all makes and models of water well pumps and complete water systems. We have three licensed pump installers and are proud supporters of the Ozark Mountain Bears. Call Flip and Pump Services to see how we can help you today. We're back. It's the Lady Antlers basketball. Ashlyn Davis with the basketball out top. Gets it over to Jade Williams. And to Briley Davis. Ashlyn with it in the corner. They're working it around. We've got a three-point basket for the Lady Antlers. 36-52. Bears leading by 16. Jalen Jackson gets it to Young. Young gets it over to Shatswell. Shatswell drives. Shatswell oh, is blocked. But it's going to stay Bears basketball. Shatswell tries to get it into Young. Two-point basket, Olivia Heffley. 38-52 is your score right now. 3.35 left on the clock. Young tries to go in. Jalen Jackson, Garden Davis. Davis gets it into Deniston. Kicks out to Briley Davis for a three. Dear Lady Antlers, now back within 11. That's going to go back to the Lady Antlers. 3.05 left. We've got Baker, Jackson, and Ricketts coming back into the lineup for the Lady Bears. Lady Bears with an 11-point lead right now. Davis loses it. Macy Young with the basketball now for the Lady Bears. Pulls it out, gets it to Baker. Baker gets it out to Jackson. Jordan Jackson gets it over to Macy Young. Kalina Ricketts. Three is a little short. It's going to be tipped out. It's going to be tipped out by Deniston. 2.38 left on the clock. Jordan Jackson taking it out of bounds for the Lady Bears. Gets it into Kalina Ricketts. Ricketts back to Jackson. Jackson for three. It's short. It's rebounded by Ashley Davis. Ashlyn drives and there is a foul. I assume that foul is going to be on Jordan Jackson. It 
It is on Jordan Jackson. Davis is going to be taking it out under the goal. We've got a timeout, Lady Bears. We're back. Lady Antlers basketball right now. Davis with it in the corner, looking inside at Denniston. Davis with it again. She's pivoting around. Tries to get it to Denniston, and Macy Young picks off that uh, steal, and she fouled. Chatswell with it, gets it to Baker. Baker, Baker with a little easy bucket under the goal there. It's gonna stay Lady Antlers basketball, it looks like. Cade Williams with it. It's going to be rebounded by Kalina Ricketts and Ashlyn Davis, and it's going to be a jump ball stain. Lady Antlers basketball. We got another jump ball. And another jump ball to uh, stop play there. One thirty left, Bears leading by 13. Shadswell gets it out to Ricketts, and we've got to travel. One twenty on your clock, 13-point lead for the Bears. Davis bringing it down to the Lady Antlers. Gets it into Denniston, but it is tipped by Kalina Ricketts out to Brooklyn Baker. Baker gets it over to Jackson. Jackson shot his little off, and it's rebounded by Ashlyn Davis. Davis gets it down the floor to Heffley, who misses the shot. Shatswell with it now gets it to Baker. Baker gets the ball, and we've got a timeout, Lady Bears. We're back. Deer just stole the ball as 
Jordan Jackson was throwing the inside. Denniston with it, guarded by Macy Young, and Denniston loses it out of bounds. Got 35 seconds left on the clock. Baker stealing that one. We got a jump ball. Jump ball is going to stay Lady Antlers basketball. Davis with a shot from the corner. Three-pointer is good by Deers. Ashlyn Davis bringing the score 54-44. Plano Ricketts drives in, tries to get it to Macy Young. Davis with it again. 10 seconds left on the clock. Not sure why my clock's not running. Three seconds left and that's gonna be the end of our game. Lady Bears win this one, 54-44. We'll be back with Senior Boys Action 